Hello and welcome to Rocky Desert. My name is Mentories and welcome back. In the last episode, we've done just some minor little details things. We kind of wanted to, well, finish off the concrete factory. What we did, and as you can see, you, you can already see it from here. Uh, you can see the power factory we've been working on and in between I've been working a lot so we're finally to a point that we can say goodbye to to the coal power so that's kind of what we did Ooh, I don't want to show the spoiler but I kind of already did and I wanted to try something new, a new way of construction, a new way of building, a new way of setting stuff up. So, normally we are building... My building style, style is kind of like making those blocks and put the machine between it and that way the machine is a little bit higher and you can walk downstairs or down below the machinery stuff kind of like uh, this you can walk under them under the belts and well I kind of wanted to change that a little bit because there is one big problem with that that it's not you're not able to view everything so we are going to try uh, it'll, doing it a little bit different and I still want to keep it neat. Oh yeah, I didn't even tell you. I also build up the plastic. So I connected to this all and there's a nice cool belt. Yeah, well, I still don't have the lifts in this build. But well, maybe it isn't the nicest way of bringing the plastic to this factory. But this, this thing looks nice. You should agree on that. If you, if you do like the look of this tower, give a like. And I'll know how much people like the tower or if I have to take it down. So, kind of the idea is to be able to have the bells lower than, uh, than your walking platform. And being able to go from one platform to another platform. So, I've set up a little bit of basic thing and I already saw one mistake so I'm going to try and fix that uh, how am I going to fix that a nice way how are we going to do that the nice way I guess it's that way yeah invalid location didn't meant to do it twice I mostly press it twice Alright, so now we can remove uh, this one and that one. So we got. Uh, let's see. Oh, I need a concrete. I need concrete. That's my main problem. Let's check that one out first. Oh, I also brought the copper this way, so let's check out how that's going this way. We've put all the coal to one entry point so we making a lot more coal and as you can see the copper is coming oh yeah there it went is coming from one line so yeah we're kind of producing copper again and I found this to be a nice way of going going there so well yeah that's how we bring the copper to this production line. All right, we needed uh, concrete. Uh, we should have uh, some by now. One, two, three. Uh, let's get back. I'm going the outer way. I do like it that you can see from the top of my factory the power plants. All right, now the major idea, uh, that's kind of annoying, is just out of the line, oh damn it. 
Alright, well, I do need to change that a bit, and I guess I'm going to get into trouble by doing this. I'm, I'm definitely going to be in trouble by doing this, uh, this way. So, this way, the factory is kind of going to be... Come on. Do it like I want it to be. It's going to be divided. I'm not quite sure where I'm going to bring the circuits here because I want to have three assemblers. Uh, let's see, one assembler. So it needs to be kind of close. I guess this is going to be. Yeah. Oh well, oh well, we'll have to redo a little bit of stuff over again. Um, that one needs to move, that one needs to move, oh man, oh well. I guess we can do it then the nice way. Need to remove that one as well. Alright. And that one is. No, that one going the other way. That one is going to that one. Alright, first the top one. The top one. Oh, I already placed it the wrong way. Oh, why, oh, why, oh, why? Alright, now the tricky part is because I got like three concrete sections here. I know it's just going to fit just in here. Alright, let's see if this is going to be... If I'm still able to fit in three. One... Yeah, that, that should be possible. Now... The hard part is coming. Oh, there's always a hard part. There's always a hard part. And the hard part is well, putting that one in here. Because I already have a feeling I placed it a bit too close. Because I got enough space here. So we're we going to place the second one. This, this does take a little bit of measurement. As you can see that one is a bit further off um, I know it is just it will be just able to fit it in here now let's see that one is working and kind of want to have it exactly uh, straight up Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. That looks nice. I wish we could do kind of like gates. Well, well, it's just an experimental something. So, well, we have to do with what we do. It's just a new building way trying to figure out uh, that the bottom one. So I'm standing, I want to stand exactly in the middle and I'm turning around and I want to look straight in the arrow, there it is. And that, that's what I'm going to make this. You are going to be connected to that one, you are going to be connected to that one and the one that's going to be standing next to you. All right, let's see. Where's my next assembler? There it is. And there you are. Now we get three assemblers and you guys are going to make circuit boards. All right, so let's see how this is going. Now the next one I'm going to stand exactly in the middle and we're going to turn around and we're going to make a little splitter. 
Yes, this is going to be perfect. And perfectly connected. And you guys are going to make circuit boards as well. Then we got kind of all the main components and then we are going off to the hover module frames because that's kind of the next thing on the list. Yeah. No. No, it's not. I guess we can make... No. Alright, I need to check that one out because I was thinking like, hey, I'm going to make some module frames, heavy module frames, but I'm going to need computers and have module frames to do this kind of crazy stuff. Uh, next, another splitter. I'm totally getting off focus. Uh, you. And let's immediately do you as well. Yeah, I'm exactly in the middle. Oh man, I might, oh, no, I'm not getting, getting punished for doing it the wrong way. Hmm, you're not kind of in the middle. I don't like that. Let's see if you're in the middle. You look like in the middle. What? What is going on? Why are you such a crazy shape? How can you be too steep? Alright, this, this is strange. Oh, you're not exactly in the middle. That's your problem. I guess this is going to be the better way to do this. Just look a little bit... Oh, that's not going to work. Alright, this time I'm standing exactly in the middle. This is truly kind of annoying. Getting it... Yeah, now you are... You are working as well. Why aren't you... No power? I thought I connected you guys. Nope, I did not. Alright, you are working. This is kind of funny. Looks like you are going back. Back and forward, that's kind of strange. Oh, that wasn't the smart thing to do. Damn. No, let's see if we can fix that the normal and easy way. I don't think we are going to... Ooh, we are. Let's see, are you now? Yeah, you are all going the right way now. Alright, that was kind of strange. Never seen that before. Uh, let's go stand on top of you. Because else I'm going to mess it all up again. Alright. Uh, Alright. So, now we are finally making the circuits. And I'm not quite sure where I'm going to... Hmm. Well, I got some ideas, but I guess my... My electricity stuff is going to be in the way. So, uh, for now... Let them just produce. And I can always expand this a bit this way. But for now, I kind of want to make it more nicely looking by doing these kind of things. So this is kind of my new building style I want to be able to do and make it possible to kind of walk above everything and have a good overview of how to to be a perfect make it a perfect factory with a lot of overview no I don't want you, I want you and I guess I do need 
Hmm. Oh well, I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do this. Maybe make a line on top of that. Well, we'll have to see how to do that. But this way, you got more overview. You can walk kind of over your factory. And make it, I feel, more... You have more of an overview. Alright, let's see. What is the next thing we need to do? I need to check some stuff out. Uh, because I, uh, I need to fix that as well. Kind of remove the bottom one. It's already all empty. So I guess I can remove that one. No, that's the wrong one. Who almost destroyed the Caterium, uh, Caterium storage place. Uh, well, uh, yeah, we can. Oh, that was the wrong one. And let's make a wall. Hmm. I'm just wondering why did I do this? Oh well, that will work. Now to get some concrete laying in there. And... Well, it would be fun if we connect this at the beginning, but well, I'm not going to waste any time on that for now because I got it kind of connected. Oh, uh, why am I removing the bottom pole? Why? I need to keep a little bit more focus on this because, well, no, just the belt. Did I remove it at the beginning as well? No, alright. Need to stay a little bit more focused. Alright. Then we uh, can remove that one and this. Well, oh yeah, I can walk again. So I'm not quite sure how I'm going to fit in these kind of constructions with multiple multiple uh, splitters on top of each other. But I guess we're slowly needing to get to the point where we're going to make the module frames. Or the module frames, the heavy module frames. And for the heavy module frames we only need to get the pipes and the concrete on top. So the concrete is kind of fun because it's already on top. But most of the stuff that we need is already on the top section. So let's take a look because we got the concrete over here. We can easily easily fix that. The pipes are already backed up and well I do think I'm going to need more pipes being built on this section and we're definitely going to do that because we also uh, pushed up the steel production so if you can see the last one should be you're off you're not producing anything oh yes yeah, because you're full and you're already at 100 percent so that that's a good thing but we can always expand the pipe construction so where are we going to build the big assembler I guess this is our way up and most of the resources are already in here so we got this deal reinforced beam we got the module frames up here so it's just a matter of getting all the stuff to to a new section and that section could be this, I guess. This would be. Uh, it's, it's depends on how much. 
How many of these things do we want? Whoa, almost fell down. Ooh, we can also go up this way. But most of the stuff is on that way, so uh, let's get a quick overview before we are going into the end of this video because, oh well, man, the video goes down so fast. So I guess we got one way up there, but we don't need the circuits, so that's not a problem. We are definitely going to remove all that. But the fun thing is we are going to build... Ooh, these things don't take that much space. I was expecting more. I was definitely expecting more. So I can kind of make one exit and make like... I guess three or four of these things. That would be nice. Yes, I, I'm. I'm going to make. I think we're going to make three or four. Yes, that's definitely what we're going to do. And let's see what we're going to need for the next one because the next one is the computers, and the computer is going to be um uh, where, uh, well, kind of where the power plant is now. And it needs steel cables, it needs, ooh, it needs crews, that's, that's definitely going to, well, we definitely need more iron for that. And it needs plastic. So that kind of convenient that we can build that on top of the coal factory. Oh man, I, we definitely got something to do next week and I'm definitely going to enjoy it. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video and well leave a like and a comment down below uh, and if you haven't already press the subscribe button and uh, we are almost ready for the big expansion and the big automations and I hope you guys all enjoyed it see you in the next factory tour because that's next Tuesday my name is Materius and keep building